because it smells. <laughs> Shoe off, everyone! We felt that science really needed to be given a greater value within our curriculum. All too often, science is taught in a, a very surface way, mostly through teaching within an interdisciplinary learning topic, and it doesn't have that depth and progression. And that's what I felt we really needed to give to science. Linda, our head teacher, uh, was looking to uh, give quality during our non-class contact time, and she felt that a good area might be to, to teach uh, science as a discrete subject. So I'm an enthusiastic scientist without a scientific degree. Um, and I saw it as a challenge and I took that on. I'm two days committed to science, teaching the whole school uh, from primary one to primary seven, and the other two days I teach primary five. When I took on this job, I thought it was rather onerous and I, I thought I really am qualified enough. But like every aspect of the curriculum in a primary school, I am not a mathematician, but I teach maths. I am not a PE specialist or sports person, but I teach PE. And I saw the same attitude with science. I looked at the experiences and outcomes, and then I thought about how best I could formulate the curriculum to uh, encourage these skills and I was able to supplement that through contact with other schools, getting people who would perhaps give me just the idea. Also within the net itself, uh, BBC Learning Class Clips have been a tremendous help to me and also has primaryscience.net, a great site that's just suitable for science at their level. But there are so many sites out there that uh, can be used. If the child is involved in their learning and take an active role in their learning, they will develop their skills to a far greater degree because they will understand what they're doing. Whether it's skills of inquiry, um, predicting, observing, recording, um, and we want to equip children with a scientific language where that they will feel that science that with science they are confident in science and not see it as a remote subject but to see it as part of everyday living. Well the reason I enjoy science is because I just moved here last year so, and I didn't know anything about science because my old school didn't have science and when I came here I was like oh no I don't know anything about science but Mrs McFarlane and some of the other children helped me and now I really like science because I get it more than any other subject I think. So I really like science.